Swift UI is getting better every year with more and more features. However, most of the latest features cannot be used in older OS versions, and we may have to wait a couple of years before using them broadly. Well, that might change pretty soon. On February 2023, Apple accepted the Swift proposal SE0376 made by Alan Shortledge, titled Function Back Deployment. In short, it will introduce a new attribute called Back Deployed to make functions, subscripts, and properties backward compatible with older OS versions. For example, in order to make this function backward compatible with iOS 13, you will have to use Back Deployed indicating the OS version before the one planning to run, and then using a variable to set the minimum version on which this function will be capable to run. Internally, Swift will make some optimizations to detect if our minimum deployment target in our app requires to execute an older version of this function. If so, then it will create a fallback version. Otherwise, it will optimize the call just keeping the original. This will be amazing for SwiftUI because we will be able to use the new features announced at .dotdc right away in our legacy code. Although it's up to Apple to decide which features will support this capability. If you want to learn more about this proposal, I will leave the link in the description and in the first comment. My name is Pete, and this this is Swift and Tips. Thanks for watching and have a great day.